Mad Maxine screams impeach Trump, soon gets smacked with nasty surprise. Maxine Waters has been up to her usual antics, threatening to impeach President Donald Trump even though he has yet to commit a single impeachable offense. This time, however, the California Democrat was smacked with a nasty surprise soon after running her big mouth. Judicial Watch has filed an ethics complaint against Rep. Maxine Waters, D.C.A., over her recent speech that encouraged the harassment of Trump administration officials in public. In a hand-delivered letter to the chairman and co-chairman of the House Office of Congressional Ethics, Judicial Watch asked for an investigation into whether the California Democrat violated House ethics rules by encouraging violence against Trump administration cabinet members, according to Town Hall. Last month, referencing White House Press Secretary Sarah Sanders being asked to leave a Red Hen restaurant in Virginia, Waters told a crowd, I have no sympathy for these people that are in this administration who know it's wrong for what they're doing on so many fronts. They tend to not want to confront this president or even leave, but they know what they're doing is wrong. I want to tell you, these members of his cabinet who remain and try to defend him, they won't be able to go to a restaurant, they won't be able to stop at a gas station, they're not going to be able to shop at a department store, Waters threatened. The people are going to turn on them. They're going to protest. They're absolutely going to harass them until they decide that they're going to tell the president, no, I can't hang with you. This is wrong. This is unconscionable. We can't keep doing this to children, she said in reference to the migrant families separated at the border after illegally entering the country. We've got to push back, Waters continued, according to Breitbart. We've got to say no. I, for example, have stepped way out there. I said this man needs to be impeached. I know a lot of people think we're not ready to say that. Some people have said a long time ago he would become presidential. He will never be presidential. This man does not have any good values. I believe he needs to be impeached, she added. As a matter of fact, a long time before he's doing what he's doing now with these children. I think he had done enough to undermine this country and to have us understand we cannot trust him, that we should have come with an impeachment resolution. So, I believe we cannot wait until the next presidential election. We have to resist him. I want to see him impeached. The move comes after several Trump administration officials have been harassed in public, including White House Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders and DHS Secretary Kirst Jan Nielsen, among others. Waters' incitement for violence, assault, and riot sets a dangerous precedent, and the House should act swiftly to disavow her, Judicial Watch President Tom Fitton said in a statement. Given the grave risk to the public safety and the rule of law caused by Waters' remarks, expulsion from the House should be on the table. While Maxine Waters screams about impeaching the President and harassing members of his cabinet, the citizens unfortunate enough to live in her district are dealing with too many issues to count. Indeed, this liberal mouthpiece has been in Washington for years and failed to accomplish anything of note for the very people who continue to elect her. It is high time she was removed from office as her blasphemous rhetoric is an embarrassment.